When you get your CallerID.com caller ID box, you'll want to open it up and quickly inspect the device. This happens to be a two-line model, and you're going to connect your Ethernet cable straight into the back, like so, followed by connecting your phone lines into either the line 1, 2, or line 2 sections on the back of the box, depending on which way you have your phone lines configured. They'll simply click in and become snug. You'll then plug in the power for your box. You'll then want to go to our website where you can configure your device. Go to settings and store settings and at the bottom of the page you'll have caller ID settings. You'll want to put in your caller ID port here From the Adelo POS, you can log in and your caller ID will appear at the top of the screen as an orange circle. Once you click on that orange circle, you'll be then able to view your caller ID data. Here's a call coming in. Now that we're in this screen, you can click on the question mark on the tickets at the bottom to review your historic, historic order, click on the plus to order this information again, or review historical information you may have about the customer. Reviewing historical information will take you to the order entry section where you can actually select items and complete your transaction.